Today we have some exciting news in regards to some brand new Pokemon Let Go updates. I'm going to be doing a lot today, but first... So today we've got a lot of news I'm going to get into, but before we do that... It's about time to give this thing away. So for those of you who don't know, I created a little mini competition from this Pogo Plus I got in Japan. They had so many of these rounds. And yeah, pretty much it's going to some lucky person. Eight and a half thousand people have retweeted the tweet. Thank you very much for entering. Let's see who gets this bad boy. And the winner is the Squirrely Nut. What a username. You know what? This feels kind of good. He said he can't find Pokemon Go Plus anywhere. Don't worry, buddy. We got you hooked up. So there we go. Done and dusted. Thank you, everybody, for entering. And hopefully we'll have more giveaways in the future. Now let's get into the news. The news. So big news today, they've got a new update for Pokemon Go, and I don't have it on iOS just yet, but all the Android people have gone ahead and downloaded it and mined all the data out of it. So as you can see here, we don't really have much in this update. Uh, updated Apple Watch to display eggs obtained from Pokestops. Cool. Uh, changed distance tracking to better account for GPS drift. Kind of a little bit edgy here because this was really good in Japan. We had really bad GPS. And then minor text fixes, which is like the big meme that they do because it means that they're added stuff to the game, but they don't tell you what it is. But these legends at the Silk Road, they know what's in it. Let's dig right into it. So first off the bat, we've got 38 new moves that have been added to the game. And a lot of these do look like Generation 2 moves, like Zap Cannon, Cross Chop, a bunch of awesome moves that will be needed for Generation 2 Pokemon. So we've got some quick moves and some charge moves here. Uh, gonna be interesting to see how they play out. Now the graphic assets are also appeared in the game as well, so it's pretty much able to be launched on the flick of a switch. So next up we have evolution items. This is interesting. We've got our sunstones, king's rocks, metal coat, dragon scale, and upgrades. So that is blossom out of the sunstone. That is uh, polytoad and slow king out of the king's rock. That is steelix and scissor out of the metal coat. That is kingdra out of the dragon scale. And that is Porygon 2 out of the upgrade. Also, it's worth noting that Sunstone does Sunkern as well, but hey, that's a Gen 2 Pokemon anyway. So it's going to be really interesting to see how these work. You might have to have candies and the evolution item. How do you get the evolution item out of Pokestops? Who knows? It's going to be interesting. So next up, we got Pokemon forms uh, that have been found, and it seems to be in the code explicitly stating unknown. You know, you got your unknowns A to Z, and your special ones, you get your question marks, your exclamation marks, and I think that is all the special ones. So it's going to be interesting, unknown, and it's going to be really annoying, and I don't know how this is going to work because you know someone's going to be out there trying to catch all the unknowns. Like, you haven't caught them all until you caught all the unknowns, which is like, at least, I think it's about 30. So that's just going to be annoying. And they better give us a lot of PC space for this. I mean, I've already bought 400 spots, but you know, whatever. Uh, nothing crazy on this next part, just a news digest so people can see what's new in the game so you can know when the minor text fixes have been added. Uh, moving on, more avatar customization. So we've got belts, glasses, necklaces. Uh, cool, we still haven't seen anything since that whole Christmas one where they added avatar customization. It's gonna be cool. And here's the big one, even more shiny and gender code that's been added to the game. I'm gonna get back to this in a second, but the shiny stuff looks interesting. And we've already got something to support the gender code. I'll show you in a bit. Gym radius tweaks, that's cool because, you know, it's really annoying when you're battling and it just goes out of range or you gotta try and get right close to the gym. That's cool. So there's some new debugging tools, which is kind of weird, but as you can see there, there's shiny in there somewhere. So that is really cool. And then we've got some new sponsor types, which is also really not that interesting. But it would be good to know that with the debugging tools being added that the variants are in their final stages of testing. So hopefully very soon we'll be ready to go. If you guys wanna read that article for yourself, I'll leave it in the description down below. And like I was saying before about those genders, we've already got one hint. If you've already got the update for the game, some of your Pokemon have been modified and this person, all of their Pikachu have been changed to female Pikachu. Note in the tail, it is like curved like a heart shape. That indicates a female Pikachu, and traditionally they are normally all not that shape. They're straight. That's male. Also, just for context, these are some of the male and female forms that they have in the game for Generation 1. Um, I actually did not know that Alakazam had one of those. Yeah, you can tell his whiskers are smaller. Now, I've checked my Pokemon. I don't have the update, so it's useless. But if you do have the update for Pokemon Go, definitely check your Pokemon. Pikachu seems to be the only one right now that is showing any sign of gender form. Also, Raichu was showing ones as well, according to the subreddit. Anyway, that's enough for the news. We're going to go out there and try to hatch some eggs and catch Lapras before this Gen 2 wave hits us big. Today's the day, buddy. I hope you're ready. So I'm just about to head out, ready to go on our adventure. But unfortunately, my Pokemon Go Plus is out of battery. Yes, we've drained it dry. I've got batteries. I bought these bad boys like a month ago, but the thing is, I don't have a screwdriver, so hopefully Taylor's gonna come in clutch and bring a screwdriver. 
when you're trying to get the mail, but there's a spider in your letterbox. Just stray at things. Hey there, buddy. Alrighty, Tay, what's up? You got the screwdriver? Yeah, I got the screwdriver. Cool hat, yeah? Yeah. Catman do. Pretty dope, nice and tight. I got the cool hat. Okay. Yeah. But, doesn't end there. The swagger doesn't end. Hmm, definitely not getting a neck burn Boy, today. It's got even more side flaps. Yeah, this is my new pokey homie hat. I don't give a damn what you say. You're probably not going to get burnt. Safe. That's what it's about, guys. Promoting sun safety. Now give us a screwdriver. It's small one I can find. That looks too big. Well, I mean, I had like 50. You had one job. What the hell? That's I tiny. I told you it's tiny. Let's see if it works. No screwdriver is going to be. It might work. 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 I told Taylor to get a small one. I think we might be good, though. I think we're good. We're W. We're lit. Okay. Skeptical at first, but we are lit. Here. It is the same battery, right? 22032? Oh, yep. You got oh, it. Man, that would have been the best. Because there's two that look exactly. Why do you need this? Any of your watch? So the meta is to apparently have both of them on at the same time because this is good for moving around. The Apple Watch is actually good for just if you're running a treadmill or in the house and whatnot. But we're going to be out and about, so it's better have Pogo Plus. Out here making a fashion statement two bands, one hand. Let's go. So the objective on today's episode is to try and hatch all three of these 10 kilometer eggs. Hopefully get some more along the way as well. And our boy Lapras is going to meet us. All right, let's get this party started. Looks like we are doing a U-turn because we didn't put the skateboard in the car. Good work, guys. I mean, props to you for realizing before we got too far. Yeah. All right, Tay's gone to grab the stuff we've already got. 170 meters. All right, now that we've got the skateboards, we're gonna go have a look and see if we can find another place that has better skateboards. We've tried to look into electric skateboards, but uh, it's, you know, being a bit difficult right now. They're always sold out. But yeah, we're gonna look at some skateboards and I need to get some internet because I've run out of all of my 400 gigabytes of 4G data and I've actually gone 30 gigs over on one of them, which is 300 bucks. Doing YouTube in Australia, it's lit, man. It's lit. My internet bill is like $1,000 this month. We come here for an Optus store. He tells me there's an Optus store here. How'd the Optus store go? Shut down. So we got good news and bad news. The good news is we've got long boards that were on discount, so that was awesome. Bad news is the Optus store has actually shut down and it's no longer there. So I don't know how this video is going to get to the internet, but we'll find a way. So the problem with today's episode is that it is Pretty so funny. hot right now. So hot. The other good news is we've already got two kilometers just from walking around the shopping center, so we'll take it. All right, we're getting this party started here. We've just rocked up. We have 2.7 Ks out of 10. So we're either going to get this 10 K or we're going to get a heat stroke because it is hot as fudge. Feels like 36. That's yeah. what the... And it's getting hotter, isn't it? Yeah, it's getting warmer. Yeah, we're just going to do laps back and forth, catch some Pokemon. I'm uh, going to check the radar in case, you know, God forbid a lot of spawns. If we pass out from heat stroke, call my mum on 1 800 hotline bling. 200,000 likes, standard stuff. So we've got these markers here that indicate how far away you are from the central point, and we're thinking we're going to go here and then go to 750 and back. Just do 1k loops back and forth, and uh, yeah. Okay, we've made it to 750, so that's exactly a kilometer, but it gave us 200 meters. No, it didn't. It did give us 200 meters. No, it didn't. It gave us 200 meters. It'll update. No, it just updated 200 meters. It's gonna be a rough. Right, heat stroke gonna... is gonna beat us. Yeah, but we're gonna beat it. Okay. We nearly got a 5k ready to go, but we are a third of the way there for the 10ks. Oh boy, so Taylor's already gone. At 5k's we get fish and chips. All right, so we're turning off the Apple Watch for now because it might be hindering our progress because we just want distance, which is better to have the Pogo Plus on. But if you're doing like a treadmill kind of thing where you're not moving, that's when the Apple Watch is better for you. Um, so we're gonna go over the bridge and come back and then grab fish and chips, see we're out, hopefully about 5k's. And then there's still a lot of hard work to go, but you know, they never said Lapras was gonna be easy. They never said that. Have a happy day. I will when I get Lapras. If we survive or if we get Lapras. Loki pushes with his back foot. Go. I push with my forward foot. But when we snowboard, I'm regular. And I'm regular as well. But I think I might be 
Anyway, what I'm trying to say is which way is correct? Let us know. Not a single cloud. This is the halfway point. Uh, yeah, halfway. Either way, let's go. How much do you reckon we got? Another 200 meters. Nah, it's wrong. Like, it hasn't updated yet. I think it has. Did you have it open the whole time? Yep. Looks like we've been swimming in the ocean. We're using serviettes to try and wipe off our sweat. This is our motivational meal to get back out there and smash out another six Ks. We've done one. No. We've ridden like four. <laughs> a bit scared of this, to be honest. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Speed! Let's get some speed! We've got just as many Ks on the car right here as we did For here. two hours here. And I am exhausted and going to die. The heat stroke wins, we're going home. Okay, so Taylor's disappeared and we have got just under three kilometers left before these 310 Ks hatch off. I'm gonna go get myself a coffee and then I'm gonna ride the skateboard. It's still really, really hot outside. So we'll see how we go. I swear, if this is not Lapras, I will be very pissed off. I just want the pain to end. Oh. Boy oh boy, I am exhausted. Big skate session just went down and we are so close. 9.43 kilometers and if I touch the screen, it doesn't go anywhere. It doesn't seem to go anywhere. You can already sense some type of uh, sunburn so you know we're off to a great start. I don't know why but I feel like these next three hatches are going to be the just most emotional egg hatches I've done here. I just want freedom. I want to start clean. I want to finish this Pogodex. I just just want it gone, but I can't because this mother fudger won't let me. I'm gonna do it. I'm so pumped. I feel so confident. Imagine the scenes if I get three Laprises, just bang, bang, bang. I wouldn't know what to do with myself. It won't happen there. If that happens, I'm gonna go buy some lottery tickets or probably not because I probably just used all my luck. End of the day, just gonna go ahead, wrap it up. We're at Nando's, three 10Ks, ready to pop. We've got Levi here from the Netherlands. Bring the Lapras with you, please. <laughs> Now, if you don't get this, it's okay. We still have three left. Last Pokemon we need. Levi, mate. What was that about? What was that about? I'm so sorry. No, it's all good. That's all good. It's not over yet. All right, Billy, you got the last one. No, no I want to do the next one. He does. It's already one, one going. And then another oh. pincer. You're kidding me. Another pincer. <laughs> Earlier today I joked about getting three Laprases. I was almost about to say, what if we got three pincers instead? This is just, this is just them throwing salt in the room, right? Okay, if I get okay, three okay. pincers, okay, Taylor, you're not getting any chicken if you get a pincer. No, 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 no. I'll donate my chicken if we get a pincer. If we get a Lapras, I'll pay for everyone's food. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good deal. Here we go. I swear, if it's a pincer, I'm triggered. I'm actually going to be triggered. Scyther. <laughs> You can eat his chicken, but like, we still hold mad L's. Hey Taylor, remember that time we spent all day on skateboards to try and hatch eggs? And yeah, and get hella, hella heat, heat stroke and hella sunburn. Yeah, I remember that. Two pincers, one scyther. Do you remember that? KMS. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Goodbye. <laughs>